with the first pick in the 2018 NFL Draft, the Cleveland Browns select Baker Mayfield. Wow. Quarterback, Oklahoma. It is Baker Mayfield. <laughs> From my perspective, he was the number four overall quarterback, right? But I know John Dorsey, and from John Dorsey's perspective, John's got a little swag, and he likes swag. He likes confidence. This kid's a competitor. If you're looking at the plus side of him, you know, he's under 6'1". He finds lanes to throw. He's thick in the chest. He's highly accurate. Playmaker, highly accurate on the move. His character has cut both ways in different buildings with GMs and head coaches I've talked with. Now, when you look at him on the field, there's a lot to like against Texas. Little pump fake, throws him open into the secondary, wide open. I like him best, though, when he's on the move. Little fake, play action, plenty of time in the red zone, pulls it down, rolls left, great throw. He throws the wide receiver open to the back line of the end zone. Again, highly accurate, pump fake, and he's, trust me, he's an athlete. He might not run four or five, He's an athletic, competitive kid. He's going to light up the locker room. What I don't like is he misses a lot of underneath coverage, especially when the pocket collapses. He never saw the free safety. It was an easy pick. I saw a lot of that when the pocket constricted. With the second pick in the 2018 NFL Draft, the New York Giants select Saquon Barkley, running back, Penn State. So one of the most dynamic running backs we have seen come out of college. He gets a hug from his coach at Penn State and James Franklin. The protector that they got in free agency, this young man is about to go to the New York Giants and play in New York City and the New York metropolitan area. Wow. Big night for Saquon a couple of nights after he becomes a newborn dad. Mike, he is unbelievable. Watch this run against Iowa, the Giants, excuse me, UFC. Double jump cut, now the cut back. He's breaking ankles everywhere. At 233 pounds, he runs 4-4. Lower body. I, we will talk about a powerful man. Watch him run through tackles. And then that 4-4 speed to the... With the third pick in the 2018 NFL Draft, the New York Jets select Sam Darnold. Yep. Quarterback, USC. So there he is, 20 years old. In other words, almost half the age of Josh McCown. It's interesting about the New York Jets. They gave up a lot, as we know, to move up three spots into that number three position. And it very easily could have turned out that they got the third best quarterback. I think, and I, we'll never know for certain, but most teams had Sam Darnold picked as their number one guy, and I'm not so sure that the Jets didn't get the guy that they would have taken had they have been the number one pick. As far as Sam Darnold, he does. He checks all the boxes. He's big. He's able to make plays outside the pocket. You look at his tape and the things that he's able to do. There's some of the creativity that he has. In fact, I think some of his best throws came when he was on the move. I should the Jets expect from you. Um, a lot of wins, you know, I think that's what I can bring to a franchise and um, But at the same time, I know that's the process um, But I'm ready to go to work like I said with the fourth pick in the 2018 NFL draft The Cleveland Browns select Denzel Ward Whoa. Defensive back Ohio State Okay, so another surprise from the Browns and all the Ohio State fans in Ohio Wow, are excited over the pick that he, Denzel Ward, doesn't have to leave the state to play professional football. It's always what you hear early in the process, Mike. Our right. quarterback and corner were the priorities when John Dorsey got there. We traveled a winding road, but that's exactly where we ended up. And think about it, this was a need. This was a big need more than defensive end was a need for them. Even though I still believe the better football player is Chubb, they fit a need with a big time athlete. With the fifth pick in the 2018 NFL Draft, the Denver Broncos select Bradley Chubb, defensive end, NC State. And again, this young man from NC State, when he heard how much Von Miller was Impressed by his game. He was He was a fan and now he's a teammate of his it is a dream moment for Bradley Chubb coming true He is a Denver Bronco as this guy knows how to hunt 
And the top edge rusher is now on the same line as Von Miller. Follow him 6'4", 270. He sets a physical edge in the run game. Violent hands. Impacts the quarterback in the pass game. And I think he's going to have a similar rookie impact as Joey Bosa did as a rookie. Mm. The field, I feel like, is just my motor, the way I play the game, how fast I play. And off the field is my family, man. They backed me up this whole time. Shout out to all my folks at Rockmar watching this. I love y'all. My parents in the back. I just love everybody. And let's With the sixth pick in the 2018 NFL Draft, the Indianapolis Colts select Quentin Nelson, guard, Notre Dame. And it's north and south. Look at that guy. Quentin Nelson, offensive guard, a 2017 Outland Trophy finalist. Quentin Nelson dominating the line of scrimmage. I mean, look at that. Look, look at those fines, to use your phrase right there on him. The draft party, they're all, they're all celebrating. Yay! Andrew Luck's going to be vertical. <laughs> Did not want to give up both first round picks, and they have stuck to that. I'm told they're giving up two second round picks and number 12 for the right to come up to seven. The Tampa Bay Buccaneers have traded the seventh pick to the Buffalo Bills with the seventh pick in the 2018 NFL Draft. The Buffalo Bills select Josh Allen, quarterback, Wyoming. Number one, I give them a lot of credit for being patient, not going all the way up to two, giving away all their draft capital. They let the game come to them at number seven, and they got their guy. Number two, think about the culture in that locker room. That's an important thing for Sean McDonough and Brandon Bean. They got rid of a lot of players. This is their kind of player. He's got crazy arm talent. Play action, under center. Watch him climb the pocket and look at this arrow. Bang. With the eighth pick in the 2018 NFL Draft, the Chicago Bears select Roquan Smith, linebacker, Georgia. Well, Coach Shaw, you showed me uh, a tweet moments ago that uh, Vic Fangio had a hole-in-one today, right, playing golf? Absolutely. This is being one heck of a day for defense coordinator Vic Fangio. <laughs> it's a double-ace day. He's he got was, pocket rockets he here. He was with us at Stanford and, and gets a hole-in-one today early in the morning. And today finds out he's got the best linebacker in the draft. And some would say one of the top two or three players in this draft, Mike. And, Coach, I would tell you that the, the MVP of Chicago's defense last year was actually Vic Fangio. They were number nine in the league in points allowed with not a lot of talent. They need this kind of talent infusion. He's today's NFL off-the-ball linebacker. He's 6'1", 235, runs 4'5", sideline to sideline. He can be a four-down. With the ninth pick in the 2018 NFL Draft, the San Francisco 49ers select Mike McGlinchey, offensive tackle, Notre Dame. All right, so some muscle, some protection for Jimmy G. Protect that monster investment that they made in their new quarterback, Mike. Yeah, six foot eight, 309 pounds. He is a flat back pile driver in the run game. He's got the work ethic and passion of his cousin, Matt Ryan. He'll set a tone both in the offensive line room and a culture in the locker room. Left tackle's got nasty to him, heavy hands. I've known this kid since he was 15 years old, and when he gets his hands locked on you and can anchor down, it's all The Oakland Raiders have traded the 10th pick to the Arizona Cardinals. With the 10th pick in the 2018 NFL Draft, the Arizona Cardinals select Josh Rosen, quarterback, UCLA. Okay, so after several years of having a USC quarterback at the controls, they will now hand the future at some point off to UCLA quarterback Josh Rosen. Enjoying a moment with the commissioner there. Arizona Cardinals is his home. Come on over here, sir. Professional football. A sigh of relief. Look at the long yeah. night. A long wait for him over. You know, I got a little tired of all the off-field stuff with him. I, I had a chance.